Hi friend, today we are going to discuss about course, one of, one of very important concept in any language. Okay, so the full form of course is cross origin resource sharing, and uh, this we use generally used to make our applications secure from any attack. If we don't want anybody can access our application, we use course course because what happens if two request is coming from two different domains so according to the browser policy one cannot use the resources when it is calling from another domain so to override this if we want if some request is coming from some another domain it can use the resources which is available on another domain so to allow this one we need to enable course for our application so for this first of all we need to install the course so one thing we can do like we can install microsoft.asp.net core.course from new package manager okay or we can use package manager console for installing this uh, asp.net core uh, dot course okay so after installing uh, this uh, package we need to configure our uh, configure services by adding policies like uh, i have created one policy so let me paste over here okay so let me make it like this now okay so what i have did i have added a service called add course okay in which i have given the name of uh, service let me choose a pane okay this one so i have given the name of my uh, policy allow all because what i am doing here i am allowing all the endpoints all the methods and all the headers okay so whatever be the request coming from any domain it will allow all those endpoints all the methods http get post post any method and any type of header it will allow but in general this is not uh, a very good practice to allow all uh, endpoints so what we can do we will discuss how we can restrict that one but before that one we need to add this uh, course policy in our uh, middleware okay so what we can do we can we need to add this line in our middleware so what we have do, did we have allowed the this policy where this policy comes from like this is same like this this is the name of my policy and i have injected this middleware into the middleware means configure method okay now i have just told that uh, it is not very much recommended to uh, allow all the endpoints so what we can do we can allow only those endpoints uh, to which we know that okay these are the safer endpoints and uh, these these are required for uh, their purpose like this we can mention https example.com so whenever a request is coming from https.example.com my application will allow okay my application will allow but if the request is coming from any another middleware up instead of this and middleware it will not allow so it uh, this code according to this code it will allow all the origins not all the origins only this origin and all the methods and header from this origin i think you got the point so what what it did it has adjusted the parameter according to the application security we can modify this example.com if we if we need to put some more endpoints okay so what we can do we can just put a comma okay after this a comma and uh, right here the second endpoints put a comma and give third endpoints whatever be the number of endpoints we we want to put we can put it over here if we want to put like uh, any specific uh, uh, method to which I, I i'm uh, i will allow like i don't allow anybody else can write into my database okay so at that time i can put i can restrict only get uh, method okay so all these origin can uh, use get method only on my application so we can do all these things so i think you got this uh, some idea about this cross origin resource sharing this is actually this is very much important for uh, uh, making our application secure and uh, preventing it from you know like uh, 
unethical access i don't want to give any unethical person access to my application like uh, somebody came and uh, taken data from my application okay so to prevent this type of thing we can use this uh, cross origin resource theory i think you got uh, what i try to uh, make you understand so let's meet in second video thanks thanks a lot